Sam Thompson. I'm from Portland, Oregon. Sam Thompson is a man of the community, uh, somebody who values friendships, his city. Uh, I'm a comedian half the time, a promoter, a teacher, a uh, community activist, uh, a big brother, an uncle. Do a lot of stuff, man. I got my hands in a lot of things out here in the city. So uh, I wear a lot of I got a big head, though, so you know what I'm saying? I can, I can wear a couple of them hats. I figure, man, if if I if I do a whole bunch of stuff, one of them gonna pop. I'm gonna get rich doing something. So <laughs> I'm gonna keep my keep my hands in everything, man. And hopefully something does uh, pop off. So are there black people in Portland? Yeah, man, it's like 15 in the north and eight in Gresham. But no, it's a it's, it's a few black folks out here. It's not a lot, but it's probably like thirty thousand of us, man. But we here. It's just not uh, horses and buggies up here. It's black folks. <laughs> So I got the name, the mayor, man, uh, from just doing a lot of stuff in the community. And when my friends go out with me, they say I'm always talking to everybody, shaking everybody's hand. So they say I'm like a politician, kissing babies and shaking hands. So they start calling me the mayor, plus with a lot of the stuff that I do in the community. I love it. Hopefully I can be the real mayor one day. Uh, support to me, man, uh, means doing for others what you want others to do for you. So... That means being present for everybody's stuff. Um, not just saying you're gonna do something, man, but really trying your best to help push the movements of others. Um, I think that you get out what you put in, in this community. And so if you're there and you're visible and you're, you're lending a helping hand to all, saying you support somebody's stuff ain't just sharing something or liking it on Facebook. It's really being there and, and helping them push their movement if it's something that you believe in, in as well. Um, a lot of people say they're supporting people's stuff because, you know, they, they, they tagged them in something. But I, I think really being there and being there for others like you want them to be for you in turn is what real support is. Win this. You and your family will get a disc of edited photos, wallet pictures, a photo session that must be scheduled by October 31st and will be within Portland, Oregon. So if you guys win this, a kid wins this, you guys, your whole family can go take pictures. If you're a senior, this makes your senior pictures free. The phrase be the change that you want to see. I believe that, you know, for any change to happen, we got to get uncomfortable first. And that, that means taking a look in the mirror and seeing what we're doing ourselves. And uh, I think that if you want to see things take hold in the community, you have to start living and walking your walk and walking the talk. And so what you say that you want to see happen, you got to start doing yourself so others can see it and see that you're really about what you say you are. You know, I grew up in a family of, of educators and grew up in church. And so my mom and my aunts were always uh, very visual in the community and, and, and a part of the movement. And it's just natural. Uh, it was a natural thing for me coming back and just start seeing a lot of things that when I grew up wasn't the same here no more. And I just figured, you know, if it's going to happen, I should be the one, you know, if, if, if I say just it goes back to that being the change that you want to see, if I want to see things be different, I had to take uh, a role in doing that. So, Man, what would I tell 21-year-old Sam? Number one, I'd tell him slow down. Slow down. You don't got to do everything uh, right now. Um, plan ahead. I would teach him about credit and about, you know, keeping your, your rental history clean and all that stuff, man. A lot of things that I just didn't know. At that time, also I tell him, stack his money. Don't, you know, as soon as you get it, spend it. Uh, just thinking about as much money as I blew when I was 21, 22 years old is ridiculous. And uh, get your credit right. Get your credit right. Because I think those those things are some stuff we just don't talk about in the black community. Uh, stack, stacking your money and, and getting your credit right. And slowing down and understanding that everything is a process. If I would have done those things at 21 and 33 today, I'd be in a lot better position than I am right now. I ain't all the way jacked up, but <laughs> I'd, be, I'd be a lot better. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm trying to have a baby next year, so uh, I need one of these chicks to uh, sign an application. We having a uh, baby mama for the love of seasoning uh, contest going on. Uh, she's supposed to be at least 5'7", brothers 6'1 uh, and over. Uh, no, nah, but no, uh, just uh, stay tuned, man. Next level. I uh, got a lot of good stuff going on. Uh, 
much much love to Activity Media. Uh, Activity Media. Ah, Activity Media. <laughs> doing their thing, man. My man can. We got a lot of good stuff going on. So, nah, heart of the art. <laughs>